Now let's add our remove to do mutation to our client. What we need to do in our to do item, let's specify remove to do mutation. We already imported GraphQL tag, so we just need to copy paste our mutation from graphical. And we need to implement our handle to do delete function. So we will also call this dollar Apollo mutate. We'll specify mutation as remove to do. Specify variables ID as to do ID. And we need to update the cache. So we'll get data from delete to do's. We will check, similar as the previous example, we will check delete to do's affected rows. And we'll also check if type is a private, is private. Now we'll get the data from by reading our query. Let's get my to do query. We get the data here. Now to remove our to do, we just now to remove our to do, we just uh, say that our data to do is equal to do filter based on ID that we pass. And the last uh, last thing we need to do is write query. The query will be get my to dos, and the data will be the data. Let's see it working. Test three deleted. Test two deleted. 